artist. I've always been a creative person and I've always loved art. I actually studied art at the University of Nevada, Las Vegas and I always find room for art in my life, whether it be painting professionally or something personal for a gift for somebody. I just always make room for art in my life and it's just a big part of who I am. is titled Bones and it was inspired by our dog Pacino. It was created about a couple of weeks after he passed away. One morning I had woken up, um, was having a very difficult time with losing him and my grief was just so incredibly strong. So I just had a blank canvas and I decided to paint him. I didn't have any idea in mind of how I wanted to do it. I just sat and I painted this painting. And when I was done, I realized that it looked exactly like my Pacino. And it brought so much comfort and peace into my heart and to the hearts of my son and my husband that I decided to share it with other people. I made thank you notes for our vets and for the pet cemetery, and I sent note cards out thanking them for how they took such great care of our little Pacino and how they took great care of our family. And from there, people started contacting me, asking me if I did these paintings for other people. And at the time, I didn't, and I wasn't planning on doing it, but I realized how much peace that creating this painting, the process of creating it, looking at this painting, it brought so much peace to my world that I wanted to pay it forward and give that same peace to other people. came about from an idea that my husband and son came up with. They decided that I should create my own cartoon character and the cartoon should be a dog who loves to paint and his name would be Artie and he would have this trusty sidekick that would help him help inspire Artie to paint. So I came up with the name Bones because Artie is was created based on my character or, and Bones was created from Pacino. And basically, Artie and Bones go around the town and they paint rocks of kindness and they hide them for the people of the community. And they have inspirational pictures and words on them to help brighten the days of others. And that whole concept was inspired by a group that I belong to that paints and hides rocks in the town. That, and my family and I actually participate in that. So it's kind of a collaboration of who I am as a person, who I am as an artist, and once again, Pacino inspiring me. And from that, I created the characters and then wrote this book, which is going to be the first in series, which each book will talk about a different subject matter, something inspiring to help others spread kindness in the world. Thank you.